In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Iris Shaders for Minecraft Java version 1.21.10. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do is go to your web browser, and I will have links in the description if you need them. But here, just go to your search bar and search up Iris Shaders, like so. Now enter, and here you'll find Iris Shaders at Dev and Iris Shaders. Click on this link here and this will bring you to this website. From there, just go to the blue download now button and then go to the blue download universal jar button. And now you have Iris installer. So as this uses a .jar file, you might not be able to run the installer as you might not have Java for Windows. So if you don't have this like installed, what you wanna do is go to a new tab. You wanna go to your search bar and search up JDK25 or Java25 and enter. Here you'll find a website called oracle.com java downloads. Click on that and this will bring you to this website. From there just click accept all. Then scroll down and then you'll find JDK25. You'll find Windows. Click Windows if you're using Windows. And from there you'll find the x64 installer. Click this link here to download and install Java25 and then you'll be able to go ahead and run the installer. So I will have a video in the description showing you how to actually install Java if you have any troubles over there. Okay, so once you have everything sorted out here, you can close or minimize your web browser. I'll close mine and from there you can go to your file explorer to access your downloads folder. Like so, right? So once you're here, just go ahead and double click the iris installer. And if you have Java for Windows installed, you should see this pop up here. Make sure the game version is correct, so it is 1.21.10. He can do Iris only or Iris plus fabric if you want to be able to add some fabric mods to Minecraft as well as your shaders. I'll keep it to default here and then you can just do install. And there you go, you're done. So now you can close the Iris installer and open up the Minecraft launcher. And from there, what you want to do is simply make sure that you have the Iris installer or Iris and Sodium for Minecraft 1.21.10 instance. And if you do, so it basically shows up here, what you want to do is simply go ahead and click on play. There you want to do I understand the risks and then you want to do play. And there you go. So now what's going to happen is that Minecraft is going to open up automatically and then you're going to have the possibility to add shaders to Minecraft as well as have sodium inbuilt. So basically here what's going to happen, you'll see Minecraft show up in a couple seconds like so and then we'll be able to go ahead and try out the features. So here we have Minecraft and what you want to do is number one, if you want, add shaders. So you can go do this by going to options here, this is a button here on the bottom, then video settings. Then you want to go to shader packs and then you will find that we can add some shaders. So if you want to add shaders, just go to open shader pack folder and then you'll be able to go ahead and add the shader folders or zip files in this directory here and then you'll be able to go ahead and actually go ahead and activate them if you want. But in this case we just have iris. So we also have these sodium features as well, like so. So if we go back to our home screen and go to a single player world, a server or a realm, I'll just go to a single player world in this case, you'll be able to see that we do have sodium. So yeah, that is one of the things. One thing you can do is go ahead and go to F3 here and you'll be able to check your FPS here. And we also have iris fabric here that shows up. Your FPS should technically be higher as sodium is present. So yeah. That is how we download and install Iris Shaders for Minecraft Java version 1.21.10. So if you liked this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see you for the next one. Bye.